Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? Hope you guys are doing well. It is a uh, good Saturday evening to you. I hope you are uh, doing well, man. I hope you guys had a good Saturday. It's a hot one here in Carolina. Uh, but uh, 10 o'clock here, trying to drive some chaos. Uh, I'm sorry, I saw K up in there earlier, man. I was about to say, try to drive some K out worth. Uh, Kenworth W900 it's on the uh, on the docket tonight so if you guys are ready for a little custom Kenworth <laughs> what's up man how are you there Cal? I hope you're doing good Julie so what's up Jaden Jughead Gamer uh, good to see you there William this fan of blanket chill what's up Josh Rogers how are you man well I'm glad you can't wait me either man Brad and what, what's up buddy Andrew M yeah a little something damn I, I have to change it up every now and again you know what I'm saying <laughs> I have to just to get a little uh, to get a little different feeling here because you know if someone likes it someone hates it and then i play something else They're like oh i love it no somebody else will hate it so that's the way it is just as he good to see you there darren richards as well uh oh a brand new coming in to overdrive so thank you there appreciate the overdriveness that's awesome man uh, i was just trying to put me over the uh yeah what is it there i was trying to think it's not letting me how many months is that there T uh, timbo doesn't matter i appreciate your support man Oh, stupid credit card. <laughs> oh, it's all right, man. What's up, Wonder? Good to see you, man. Uh, I know. I do, too, Andrew. I do, too. Uh, it, so, yeah, I, I just change it up every now and again. I, I, got, I got to. Akeem, what's up, man? Good to see you, man. Uh, where's old Terrence Lee? Like seven. I, for whatever reason, I'm putting my mouse over, and it's not telling me how many months. Like, neither screen is doing it. <laughs> I'm digging me off. That's what I do, man. Uh, White Bear was up, my friend. He's working on two Sinister. Was that is that an extra? What's this? A six months? I think. I, shoot, I can't even remember my own emblems now. It's so flipping terrible, man. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Mark, what's up, man? Peace, uh, peace, James Game. And thanks for the compliment as well, man. Appreciate that. Um, who else we got in here? Brian Sanders was up. Pop Tyler, Patrick D. Good to see you, man. Faded as well. Jacoby Reynolds, uh, Jay Struck. What up, Boston? Up, Boston ready. What's up, man? Sammy. Uh, Dr. Dre, we got Tyler in the house. Chanel, uh, who else we got in here? Zenus was in here. Richie Miller, uh, Cal was in here early. Uh, Mr. Nick, and uh, yeah, I got Richie. All right, Kevin Jones, what's up, man? Carrie Howell, hello. Thank you there. I uh, appreciate the sub actually 11 minutes ago, Carrie. Appreciate it. Uh, James Allen, what is up, my friend? How are you there? Brian King as well. I am doing good, man. I hope you're doing well, Brian. Bull Holler, what's up? Yeah, we haven't driven, uh, we haven't driven the Kenny in, in quite a while, actually. It's been, been a couple of weeks. So we'll kind of start going through some of the stuff uh, as well. I've been working on um, some nice cinematic shots for our uh, kind of like our, our smaller video spotlights on some of these mods. You guys can see a little bit more in-depth 
uh, what some of these are. So I know Chaos got a he's got a couple new ones out redoing the Mac F seven hundred. So you guys, uh, you know, as soon as we roll that one out, uh, it's going to be rolling uh, as well here on the channel. So anyway, let's go ahead, let's roll some beautiful bean footage here, and uh, let's go ahead and let's get started here. Rolling heavies tonight. So I've got the low boy there from Pinga. Uh, so we got a, what else we got? We got a few little maps in. We've got, you know, pretty much our same standard, uh, our kind of stream set. So anyway, hope you guys are ready for a little heavy hauling tonight. We'll see how we get along. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. All right, well, there we go. I think everything's uh, set and ready to rock and roll, I think. I'm trying to figure out my light over here so I don't get the uh, don't get this nasty light coming in on the corner of the camera. So anyway, I may, I may have to adjust that just a little bit. I've been trying to figure out a new way to mount some cams up. So but anyway, what's up there, Gunner? I hope you're good, man. Uh, <laughs> thanks, James. Appreciate it. What's up, James Allen? Good to see you, bud, uh, as well. Um, a nice Andrew. Have done quite yet, yeah, dude. It's 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 a lot to dig in. It's a lot to dig in ATS too, man. I don't even know where to start sometimes on a you know like especially for these guys uh, on ATS. It's 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 a little bit. Uh, oh, what's the best way to say this? Um, a little bit new to it. So you throw too much at them, it's just overwhelming. There's just so much stuff out there. So it. Uh, well, it's still it's uh the guy is uh, Jacoby is working on the extender. So I'm actually, I think if our uh, if our conversations uh, correct. Basically, what I'm going, hey, what's up, Mr. Worldwide 007? Coming in for another one, man. All right, man. Overdrive member there. Uh, and he is up to a year. That's the year emblem there. So, Mr. Worldwide, I appreciate it, man. What's up? Well, Perfect Dipper, if you could have been here last time, we hauled cattle haulers for uh, for people like you, man. And you missed it, man. I am so sorry. How do I have that much money? I modded it in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I bought it all that in. So yeah, man, appreciate that worldwide. Always, man. Big Jim, what's up? How are you, man? Uh, J Cap, good to see you there. Cone as well. Gamer Ethan, uh, Braden. Who else we got in here? Missing anybody else? Yeah, it's pretty much else. Yeah, I like it, man. I, I like the classics. I like the Kenny. I, I like them all, honestly. We drove the Peter, uh, the Peterbilt uh, 389 from Ruda. We drove that one. We had a custom skin on that. Uh, White Knuckle Gear Jam. What's up, man? Caden, what's up? Uh, and then we also had, uh, we drove the Freightliner Classic XL. We've drove two two big-time classics, the Dodge CNT and the 9300 International from Cash Shadow Walker Modding. So it's like literally been kind of like Truck Update Central has been starting to roll in here. So once these guys fully get everything updated, we're going to start working on getting some uh, some good vids, plus live stream vids as well uh, with you guys. And also Pinga has got a 389, so we're going to be featuring that here at the very beginning of this week as well, which should be good. It's a very highly customizable 389. Um, and I had some issues with it at first with it, uh, you know, crashing and, uh, some other things. And I think it was some conflicts with some things I had going on. So at any rate, uh, I think I've got all that stuff squared away. So look for that very beginning of this week. We want to run some of that. So, uh, so yeah, it should be good, man. It should be good. Chronic. What's up, man? I think I saw bear as well. Good to see you there, bear. Hope you're doing well, man. Um, sorry to get to come in and holler at you guys before we got started, but I'm just coming in liggity split here. So oh cooper yeah i don't know man probably i don't know it depends if someone takes it up man it'll up it, it'll uh it, it'll update through steam as far as someone else is updating it as far as i know that truck will probably die unless someone picks it up so that's why i'm trying to try to show you guys a lot of new trucks that way you guys can uh you know y'all can check it out so anyway uh we are in let's i'm gonna show you guys what we got here we got the uh kenworth uh 900 there from mr um uh, Mr. John Ruda. Links are in the description, by the way. Trailers, you can find this is the Magnitude Lowboy from Pingas. Uh, we're also running Sierra Nevada, uh, which you'll actually get to see a little bit of that. We're going to be driving through that as well. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much all we got. So, we've got, uh, Jay, we got the 3406 from uh, Z Mods in the Steam Workshop. So, one of my faves. Uh, I think this one, I think the Highway Killer's 30. The Peterbilt 389 from his is 25, and I think the Freightliner, I think it's 15 or 20. I can't remember. Something like that. Uh, Perfect Dipper will get them as soon as, uh, as soon as they update, man. We're still waiting uh, on an update to 137, so the, supposedly they're supposed to be testing that tonight. Um, you give or take. Um, so we should hopefully have something here in the next, I don't know, I mean, I hope this week. 
Uh, Jacoby, I'll use the M14 loop when it actually works on a truck that I'm driving. So it doesn't actually work on John Ruda's truck yet, so that's why I don't have it in. You pretty much have to drive a default or you have to drive one of the GTM trucks for that one to work. And I just haven't gotten that far yet. Yeah, so we're pulling in uh, about 100,000 pounds plus truck. So we got a uh, we got a lot of weight with us tonight. So uh, I use Vipers typically, Jacoby. I don't, I don't. I'm not a big fan of the the 900A. I like the 900B from GTM. Um, yes, Worldwide, I will do one for this truck. I just have not yet because we don't have the, um, the open definition file for it. Um, we don't have the open definition file and the template for the 900 yet. We have the Freightliner and the 3D9, but not the 900. So. Uh, so, not really any free. The, the default 900 is about the best. Um, there was an edit that Pinga did, I think, of the Kenworth. Um, hit or miss, whether or not people like it. What's up, Kev? How are you, man? Edward, what's up? Long time, what's up? Good to see you, bud. Uh, or a psych for Idaho. Yeah, I am there. Thanks for the $2 there, Perfect Dipper. Um, I am psyched, man. I'm just kind of ready for him to come out. I mean, I feel like we got a bunch of, uh, bunch of hype there for a bit, and then things just went, you know? I mean, it's like, it's like, like our, like our boys just vanished that into thin air. <laughs> So we're like, ah, uh, wait a minute, what is happening? So they said uh, COVID-19, so yeah, I'm going to give them a pass for a few bit. Yeah, man. Yeah, I, I got you there worldwide. Yeah, I, I do too, man, uh, between his his trailers. All getting really nice updates as well, so yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be excited to see what all happens with those. It should be good. Yeah, see, I don't know if it did or not, his Barracuda, because I, I, um, it's been a while since we hopped into Kenworth, and honestly... By the time you add some wheels, add a few accessory packs, or add some sounds, man, the default 900 is still a legit truck. Just doesn't have all the custom, you know, slamming it and all that stuff that most guys, you know, might want with a truck like that. Giga, what's up, truck dog? What's up? Hope you guys are doing well. I do not have my CDL. I have my CDL in a lot of hours of ATS. <laughs> Axel, thank you there for the sub, man. Appreciate it. Uh, convoys on Saturday stopped, Andrew, because the, they, uh, they, they have not updated Truckers MP yet. We're still waiting on their update. Um, they said that they, were gonna, that they were still working on a few things, and they were testing today. They were supposed to test last week. That didn't happen. I don't know, man. I don't know. Um, so we'll, I guess we'll find out. Um, so we thought maybe that Idaho would get an update. Um, or at least Idaho would release they would update, but that really hasn't happened. So I think we're working on plus a month. It's almost like a month and a couple of weeks now. Um, so it's kind of um, uh, it's, it's kind of tough, man. Hey, what's up there, pickaxe? How are you, man? Uh, I think this one's six, uh, like six thirty nine or six forty nine, Jaden, on this engine set. Yeah, I'd imagine it probably was Marcel. I know every time someone put in something about TMP update, it just gave you there. We're working on this and should be that. And I was like, man. <laughs> that's like keyword bot response. I was like, oh, man. I was like, people stop watching my channel if I ever gave them a bot response. <laughs> Ooh, which is my favorite. The Freightliner Classic. They're Adonis. Or Adonai. Hit the Jake. All right, we're going down the hill. So, all right, whatever. Yeah, that would be actually kind of cool, Andrew. Wouldn't mind that at all. Actually, I'm actually kind of stoked to see what Montana is.
There you go. Yeah, there's a mod for Montana. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Marcel, I'll be honest, man, I had to leave all of that, dude. I, I mean, I left Truckers MP. I left so many Discords, dude. I was just like, I cannot take. Like, I'm just looking for, like, random info here and there. Looking for, uh, you know, something to, something to pick up, some useful information. And it's just constant. I'm like, oh, my God. <laughs> Like, oh, I'd hate to be a moderator for TNP right now. Especially for their Discord. Be terrible, man. Yeah, we can add some more in there, Barracuda. We, we may even, we may even, uh, we may do a, a nice heavy one here on the next one. I've got a few more uh, kind of cool loads we can, we can haul around. I'm kind of doing a little bit of short trips. And we're trying to just kind of cycle in as many loads. And we'll, we'll pull a cow trailer tonight. How about that? Uh, yes, J Cap. Yeah, all those are my own, my own creations. Uh, Michael, we're in the Sierra Nevada. This is Northern California, Northwestern uh, Nevada here for, uh, made by the same guys that do the uh, Viva Mexico Team Reforma. I've done a few there, Marcel. I, had done, I hadn't done a lot of them. Look at their dab gaming. Jeremy Hart, what's up, man? Hey, dude, I got your message, man. Killer, killer job, dude. I just didn't literally, I, I had saw it passing. I was like, I'll have to hit him up later tonight when I can actually, uh, when I can actually tell him. That was good, man. I'm digging it. We'll get a, uh, um, I'll get with you, man. We'll get, like, an official, like, you know, release with it, an official, uh, you know, mod image, and, you know, we'll, we'll let, we'll, I'll let you brand it. We need to get that, uh, if you've still got, if you've got all the, we, we need to get you on that on a, uh, a NASCAR trailer too, man. <laughs> do I change my wheel? What do you mean, this wheel? Uh, I've only got three. I've got F1 wheel and this one and then a rally wheel. So. Oh, forgot about this one. We should go on the other way. That was our, that was our bad. Oh boy. Stomping on the brakes, stomping on the brakes, stomping on the brakes. Yeah. Should have gone the other way. Whoops! Yeah, there's just a collar on the back of these. Uh, it's a little, little lock collar, you just twist it and the wheel pops right off. Uh, Jay, I don't think I did anything Thursday. Honestly, it's uh, things are really busy right now. So um, I'm trying to do things on the backside, like you know, just random stuff that I need to do. Uh, but then the life, man, we've been busy this. This has just been a crazy week. I'm hoping things kind of slow down as we get back to a little bit of normalcy. You know, with this whole COVID-19 stuff, and my job was actually got a lot busier, which wasn't really that great. But you know, it is what it is. Oh, yeah, man. Dude, it was good, man. It was good. I liked it. I saw it. I was like, yes. It's like, that's good, man. I like I like the custom stuff like that, you know, the one-off that probably wouldn't fly on a Kenworth 680, but it looks great on the on the 389, you know? <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, actually, this is good, man. This is a, this is a 14 inch. It's not a 15. I I wouldn't mind a 15 or 16 inch uh, wheel. Um, I've actually thought the 14 would be a little bit bigger, but I mean, honestly, for what it is, man, it's it's good. I like it. What's up, Mr. Coben? How are you, Mr. He's the uh, dev there for um, for the Great American Maps. Good to have him in chat. You guys know Ki. He was in here earlier, so good to have guys and creators coming in to say hey. Uh, Ollie, yes, we'll go back. We'll go back once they update, man. We'll go back to our Friday and Saturday uh, convoys. I just figured, you know, we'll still still get in with the Saturday crowd, man. And summer's warming up. We got all the people get out, and do stuff. Things are finally reopening, so 
you know yeah i don't think people really necessarily mind too much of this stuff on the uh, weekdays but you know i i think you guys enjoyed seeing the the multiplayer stuff on the weekend something a little different you know Hey, what's up there, Justin? Cope. What's up, Sheldon? How are you, man? Uh, would I put one on a Thrustmaster? Only if you could find a good way to fit it, Jacoby. I mean, I'm sure you can probably find um, some different uh, some different options. I, I personally just you'd have to find some type of a set nut or a um, you know a set nut or a extension like a four or five inch i wouldn't put anything too tall and heavy on that one i mean i'm on the fanatec so it's like a huge block man and it's all um you know it's it's all metal so i don't i'm not necessarily worried about that uh i should be ollie <laughs> i have no idea whether i actually am or not if it uh if it actually <laughs> if it's turned on then yeah i am <laughs> Yeah, I had an all right week, Sheldon. It was just busy, man. Which is not necessarily a bad thing, you know? It's, it's all good. No, I haven't driven an 18-inch wheel. Not besides, like, I guess a, a, a truck, actual IRL truck wheel might be close to 18. <laughs> uh. Yeah, we're at uh, about 100K on this one. So we're 100. Whatever's in the box, I have no idea. Uh, we've got some other excavators, bulldovers, and uh, front end loaders. We'll <clears throat> pull some heavier loads here on the next uh, the next go around. Uh, forty nine hundred, yeah, forty eight is what I have. Forty eight hundred, I believe. That's the one from RTA. Cash Shadow Walker, I think he did a forty eight hundred. So I'm not sure if the forty nine, unless it's just an engine variant. No, no new news on new truck. Uh, I doubt we'll probably hear anything till the end of the year. That's my guess. Um, but that would be literally my guess. Make sure I don't miss a turn. Yeah, we're good. All right, if you don't know where we're at, we are in the we are in the uh, Sierra Nevada map, so we're on our way back to. I think we're going back to Sacramento, which is actually uh, once you hit back on the interstate, man, it's awesome coming back into Sacramento. And we'll uh, we'll maybe try to drive south. We'll pick up a couple of more low boys. We'll do a cattle haul trailer for those that want to see the cattle hauler again. Pull that out. I don't mind. I, don't, I definitely like to uh, to do a couple of loads here via the one I'm actually featuring on the stream. So. I don't know if he is now unknown. He had some issues, and I'm not exactly sure what they were, but it was stopping him from, from using PayPal, um, I, and I have not contacted him since, so I'm, I'm not exactly sure. What's up there, Captain Chaos? How are you, buddy? I'm sure 100,000 pounds going down this hill is probably not a problem. We'll be all right, right? Uh, that I don't know. I, I don't, you know, I don't personally talk to these guys all that often. Um, so, you know, John, at least for me, man, I've, I'm just a paying customer like the rest of you guys. <laughs> so, it's not like, you know, we, you know, shoot the breeze and, you know, grab a virtual beer. <laughs> Sir, we are rolling, man. Yeah, we're rolling. 92. Woo! Y'all don't see that very many times in this stream. What's up, Willie? How are you, bud? Uh, well, Ollie, yeah, they'll they'll run race miles if they have to. We, we're under we're real miles, but I, well, honestly, man, we don't care. 
really don't. I just want people to drive and have fun, man. That's that's all that really is necessary. There's no hoops to jump through. There's no, you know. What's up, Jacob? Bound War Man, Alexis. Uh, you know, I need to get him, dude. I need to get him on the FL 120. I have not gotten FL 120. So, but yes, Alexis, I will do that because I actually like that. I actually like the uh, the FLD that used to be on the workshop. I was a fan of those. I know, Andrew, take a picture. It'll last longer. Ahmad Khan, what's up, man? Uh, can you scan iRacing cars and trailers? Well, you can do the cars. Um, I'd have to give you my graphics on that one, Jeremy. Um, I'll show you what I'm talking about. We'll, we'll catch up. Because I've got a lot of stuff that I was going to do myself that I just haven't gotten around to doing it. But I'm totally cool if you want to adapt that paint on to a, uh, to a NASCAR hauler, man. It'd be awesome. Yeah, man. Uh, Deathfire, we're still using the 3406 Caterpillars uh, sounds from uh, Z Mods. I think he said these were all recorded out of a real 359, I believe. Oh, there's Popo. I'm <laughs> sure we'd get a ticket for doing that. <laughs> Hey. Yeah, it sounds more epic on the inside there. It's a 3 s miles there. Think they're crazy. Yeah, it's good, man. I, I, we don't really have many Kenworths, you know. There's a, there's a couple of floaters. You got an 800. You got a 900. You got a 610. And there's a couple of randos out there, but nothing like a, just a straight up free, like legit kind of customizable Kenworth 900. You know, something that's got a lowered frame, lower chassis. There's really not a lot of options out there. You know, obviously Peterbilt, we've got a ton, but, um, you know, really even on the Freightliner as well. I mean, we just don't have a lot. Most trucks nowadays have run straight payware. And there's a few trucks that are free just because they've always been free. Um... But, uh, yeah, it's kind of crazy if you think about it. I mean, a lot of the trucks I drive are all payware. All right, going to exit right here. Let's see. Love it, man. Look at these interstate system here. You're coming up here on this uh, bottom right of your screen. Let's check and see how like how crazy that is. It's wonderful. The default one, unfortunately. Yeah, it's uh, well, Jeremy, it's a uh, Sacramento. I mean, it's uh, they man, they did a really jam up job on the uh, the road network here in Sacramento. Really is good. Uh, yeah, Andrew, not uh, the guys. Man, oh yeah, sorry, I was meant to tell you. So uh, the the shifter top is done, from what he uh, told me. He's working on the shifter extension because it's going to need to be a custom one. Uh, so I think he's uh, doing that out of a uh, um, carbon fiber, carbon fiber tubing. So, yeah, I'm like, <laughs> it's, it's gonna be legit, guys. I can't wait to do like a kind of a real reveal for it and uh, tape, you know, at least uh, kind of show off what I got there. And it's gonna be nice, man. Custom, completely custom American, and nobody else has got one like this. I can assure you that they wouldn't pay for it. <laughs> yeah, it is, Jaden. Yeah, it's going to be good, man. I can't either, man. I'm excited. I've seen a couple pictures, but he's been very, very elusive. Very elusive with it. Use the right lane. Oh, yeah, right. Bull. I'm, yeah, I'm tired of it, man. I am so tired of it. I, I got used to it. And then, of course, now, honestly, now, like, I'm getting used to this. I'm going to have to get used to uh, 
I'm about to get used to using a uh, an actual Eaton Fuller style shifter again, man. It's gonna be a little bit crazy. <laughs> uh, I'll say, Braid, it's uh, it's not even well. I think it is, but it's um, uh, we'll just say it's billet. How about that? Yes, Kona, they're actually doing some really good stuff, man. They're actually got a couple of things in development, and I have no ETA on that. I have no ETA on Idaho. Like, all the things that you guys want to know, I don't have a clue about any of it, to be honest with you. <laughs> and if you guys are interested in any of this stuff, all the links are in the description. Go check them out. I don't play crew too. I, I honestly just barely have enough time. I enjoy ETS on the side. I don't do as much just because I just don't have a streamable time to really develop an ETS two audience. Um, yeah, it would be nice to be able to stream that, but I, you know, honestly, everyone's here to watch ATS, not ETS. So, if I could stream a little earlier, like do two, you know, eventually uh, when I have more time. Um, then I might be something I could potentially do when that way and I'd actually have an audience that would be more receptive to it But it's a little bit a little bit tough now. What's up Jody? How are you man? We have revived All right, so I'm just gonna do the easier one because I'm not gonna get yet. Yeah, no not gonna happen Get a stretch lowered chassis in here yeah, I've got to drive a, a, a real one. Uh, I mean, I guess the I've got the concept. Uh, as for the feel, uh, it take me probably take me a few runs to do that one. What's up there, Hunter? How are you, man? Uh, no mirror mods. Yeah, I don't have any of that. Y'all need any mods from your current truck you're driving? Nope, it's just the truck. Just the truck and trailer. You've got the Alcoa 2.0 wheels from Jess Mods. That's about it. <laughs> Probably wouldn't like you saying that there, Bull. <laughs> oh, thank you, Junior. I'm, I'm trying, man. I, you know, we're getting where I've... If I'm just driving by myself, man, I usually don't miss much. But, you know, trying to constantly keep up with chat and all the stuff going on, I usually I'll miss some here and there. Got no trailer maneuvering bonus. Sorry there, FTG. One short of a box of cookies. So, all right. So, yes, yeah, so here's what we got. We got Great America over here, which we did a couple of nice rolls in that. Um, it, might, it might even just just fly to one of these places here to close out our stream or something. But right now, we're all over here and all of this this just curvy goodness over here that is Sierra Nevada. So, uh, if you have no idea, have never seen this map, hang around because I think you're going to like it, especially leaving out of... Uh, Sacramento here's all right. Let's pull us um, let's pull us something decently heavy here. <clears throat> uh, the Lee Bear seven seventy six has got some weight to her, and the eight thirty six K's got some weight. Some like a mining uh, a mining front end loader. We got the scraper tires. Bleh. Uh This transformer is pretty awesome, but it's uh, not very heavy. Oh, we got the box. Uh, looks like we've got... Oh, the milling machine. I bet that looks good on there. Man, you know how long it's been since so we did a, a milling machine? A long time. Got the Volvo A40s on here. Nice. All right. Let's see. Let me give you guys a few choices. Uh, how about the 836K? We can do that one. We can do a milling machine or crane for number two. And one of these A40s. These Volvos, rock truck. How about that? Well, that's a load we haven't done in a long time. And then we've got the, uh, yeah. So, yeah. So, 836K, which is uh, this beast right here. It's like a mining truck with, like, metal wheels. And uh, and then we could do the milling machine crane, either one of those, for 70K. Or we can roll the Volvo rock trucks. Good Lord. Hey, I just popped through there. What's up, Mo? How are you, bud? And thank you there. Someone uh, PayPal'd in. I won't, I won't do names, um, but thank you there for the $10 there on PayPal. Somebody did that, so thank you there. Appreciate it. Very much so. <laughs> uh, with Cascada. 
836, 836. All right, it's 836 looks like what y'all's. No drill rig on this particular one there, uh, bull hauler. All right, let's do um all right, let's let's do the 836. I'll pick somewhere a little bit short just so we don't have a huge 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 uh crazy haul on this one. And then uh if we got some time, it goes right back to where we were. Let's see if we go somewhere else. Red Bluff. I would like to go south. If we could, it'd be nice. Um, so when I got mine rocking the base, uh, it was a little bit, it wasn't as popular. Um, I think I still waited about three weeks just for, from start to finish plus shipping. And I know now it's up to two months, but I have heard that that's just, it's, you know, it is what it is. But they're still, you know, they're still, um, I think it's up to two months, but they're still, you know, doing their thing, man. So it's, uh, it's taken, um, they, they've, they've like completely just, you know, all of a sudden just started you know doing extremely well so i mean everybody I mean, really you can't really buy those out unless you're actually in some of these racing groups these racing bucks and box guys does them or you create them yourself um or you know if if you know you're lucky enough to be able to actually do that do that yourself man i, I would love to do some button box building and um i would love to do some of that i just yeah more like time Hey guys, sorry we couldn't drive today. We're just, you know, we're just chilling in the shop, you know, working on a button box. So you want to watch? <laughs> Don't make it weird. Hey, Captain Chaos. Thank you there, man. $20 super chat from the Chaos Master. Ah, man, I certainly will, man. Uh, because we haven't uploaded a, um, uh, a mod, like a cargo image for it. That's why. Yeah, do not play Roblox. Nope. Yeah, yeah, we're, yeah, it really would, Elu. <laughs> Which is some parts of that I actually kind of think would be interesting, you know. I'm actually building a, uh, like a wood, like an actual real, like, uh, I do woodworking on the side, so I'm actually building a, a custom conference table. I thought about just setting my camera up in the shop and being like, hey guys, what up? I got some work to do tonight, and it does not involve trucks, so, yeah, I'm not going to be watching chat, but you guys are more than welcome to peer over my shoulder and tell me what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> Oh, because, you know, that's what would happen. HFTG, I probably wouldn't use that kind of sooth at all, Blade. <laughs> I'd probably use a 90 tooth. It does less, uh, less wood shards at the end. Oh, better stop, truck. I've thought about a Barracuda, but I don't think my family's ready for uh, any IRL stuff. But honestly, man, it's like coming back and then having to edit it down and put it. And I'm like, I don't even have time for that. <laughs> you know, just fine as well. I know, right? I know. Right, turn around and be like, hey, when would y'all get here? <laughs> uh, he's got it adapted, Richard. Not, uh, It's not fully updated. He's adding some more stuff. He's going to put the window animations in. Um, all of that good. So he's got a few more. Plus, he's doing a trailer update on that. So, I mean, man, all these guys, dude, are fixing to do some huge update stuff on these trucks. All right, we got 13 miles for a pickup. So, we're going to pick up the 836K Caterpillar. And we got a traffic queue like crazy. I wonder if I put the traffic on three still. Hmm. Not exactly sure. Slightly Tyler, it is in the description. John Ruda. Hey, Facebook, just send him a message, tell him you're interested in it. I think this one's, I think the Highway Killer's 30. And is, uh, he's got the Peterbilt 389. You guys probably seen me drive that one. That was 25. Freightliner Classic that we did a while back is 15 or 20. Next week, that's what I thought. I thought I saw that next week or the next. <laughs> We'll see, we'll see, Crutch. We'll see. Hey, nice, Ben. Sweet, dude. I need to work up a skin for that in there, Braden. I need to get her company skin up on the uh, 100. Hmm. I don't know, Bull. It probably pretty uh, CPU intensive, I'd imagine. I, it might be on three, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. 
I hear you there, Jordy. Jordy. Yeah. I get that way too, man. I gotta look for something it's like, hey, what can I buy, man? What's new out there? What's what's good? <laughs> I think it might hit old blades up. I'm liking his Mormon. I've always liked it. I just wanted it out a little bit and see what guys thought about it and see if they liked it. Oh, oh, oh. Well. Yeah, it's funny, you know, Seifer. Um, so we drove the 108 and the 200, but since they're like Aussie styles, like nobody showed up. They were like, man, don't like the Aussie cab overs. <laughs> and then they'll be like, hey, can you do the FLB? I'm like, well, I just did two awesome cab overs. Meh. Don't really like them. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, it's kind of funny, man, the way chat and like viewership on different trucks work. I like driving different ones because there's always somebody out there that wants to see something. You know what I mean? I know. I actually like them, man. That's really one reason I like ETS, man, because I like the uh, I like the turning radius. It's wonderful. <laughs> it's absolutely wonderful. And it seems like all the really like cool cab overs are just private mods, and nobody actually like shares them or sells them. You know, it's just oh, this is a private one for my myself to drive and. I'm just going to post pictures of these so you guys can all ask me where it came from and I can tell you it's a private mod. Okay, alright. There you go, welcome to the sack. Five lanes wide, or four lanes. Tell you what, this truck moves when you ain't got no load on it. Good lordy. Mad necessary, what's up pal? How are you buddy? Look at this man, look at these exits, love it. Take the exit on the right. Double exit. This is what this is honestly the way that Take the exit on the right. this is really what SES needs to do with their maps, I'm sorry. Take the exit on the right. If guys are doing this for free, man. Mm. <sighs> for shame. <laughs> oh wow Seaver nice man Josh Master what's up man eh, I don't always speed but when I do I do it on live stream uh, you can Jacoby you see to make sure you need to do the research or you need to call someone and ask you tell them what you're wanting to do and what you're wanting to put. And you have to know what what pieces you have and to know whether or not it's going to be compatible. Sometimes the video cards are not compatible with motherboards or the way in which you might would want to run them aren't compatible. So you need to do a little research and, and check that, that stuff out. So. Absolutely there, Matt. Can we get all 18? Yeah, I guess. I usually skip a few, you know, on my way to 18. Mainly because I don't have the shift, all the buttons. I have to do it via the two buttons on my thumb. It's just annoying. That's typical why I don't do them now. I'll, do, I'll actually do them, though, when we get this load on here. Because I'll have to. I was about to say, I can't see that car where to go. <laughs> hey, what's up there, Karun? Is that Karun? Or Karen? Is that Karen? Karun, oh my god. It's like K A R E N, but like, hey, Karen! <laughs> oh, woo! Sorry about that. <laughs> Uh, would I do Facebook streaming? Uh, yeah, you know. So I, I, I have a, a love-hate relationship with Facebook. I just hate the social media network side of it. I hate it. I can't stand it. I can't stand going to these groups and not being able to check out the mods of the creators that I'm here to do. Like, I love these guys, man. Bart, K.I. Shadow Walker, man. I love those guys. They do an awesome job with their mods. They've been good to me. They've worked so well with me. And I just hate going into their groups, and I would love to plug in more, 
but I hate going in there and I can't see up oh, anything except for Range Rover and my left front fender. Uh, I can't see anything except for guys driving ridiculously fast and just running off of mountains and everyone hee hawing. Like, I, I just can't stand it, you know? Um, and so when I go in there, I don't ever get to see what the, the developers are doing, you know? Uh, all I see is where everybody has just shared everybody's stream for a self shout out, and it's just annoying. So uh, I typically don't do it, and knowing that me, I would probably have to do some of that to get some traction in Facebook. And to be quite honest with you, I just don't feel like doing it. I've spent two years building up YouTube, and I have no inclination to want to go over to Facebook and do it again. No matter how good it would be, man. I've got a loyal base here, man. Uh, great guys in the Discord. I mean, I wouldn't change it for anything, honestly. Thank you there, Matt. Appreciate it, man. What's up, Deuce? Deucey. First time you see me crash and see, that's a statement right there. <laughs> Hey, what's up there, Mr. Lucasse? How are you, bud? The infamous Skinner is in the house. The guy that does all those awesome skins and skin packs and multi-truck skin packs and whatnot. There he is right there, man. Yeah, I'm good, man. It's good to see you in stream. Hope you are doing well. We are great guys. No, the great guys aren't everywhere else, too, you know. <laughs> it's me. It's me, guys. It's not y'all. <laughs> you do what you can. I dare you, man. All right. Let's pull this one in here. Oh, truck of my choice. I don't... Uh, for, for um, well, I have to... If it's going to be that, I'd have to... I'd have to... Uh, I have to check out... Um, Oh, what you call it? Um, the Freightliner Classic would be the one I had to get closest to that one on Brian. I don't know if uh, I need to check see if he's actually uh, accepting any um, any PayPal's. I'm not sure if he is. I know at least some guys have not been able to buy trucks from him, so I'm sure he's like probably working overtime to do that. So, um, so let's uh, let me let me put that one in the bank there, uh, Brian. Let me let me. Um, Let's uh, let's get that Freightliner Classic out uh, here. We'll do a giveaway of that one here in uh, early this week. What you think about that? Is that good with you, man? I don't know if we're gonna make that turn. Knock the guy off there. Get to work. Uh, yeah, he puckered. He puckered. Why don't I partner up with someone to make my own mod? I don't know. I'd just rather drive someone else's. <laughs> I don't know, man. It seems like a... I don't want to say it seems like a waste. Um, I mean, I, I yeah, I don't know. What what would you do? If somebody came in there, hey, Seifer, thank you there, Just Because, man. Thank you there, Seifer, man. $20 donation there from Seifer, Just Because. Appreciate it. Patrick D., what's up, man? Five dollars there from uh, for Patrick T. Uh, how much? I think it's fifteen. I think there, uh, Brian. But I, I don't make the mods. That's the thing. I, I I'll do some uh, I do some skinning. Oops, that light is way too bright back there. Sorry about that. Um, I do some skinning, and I'm still still learning a lot on that front. This thing going nowhere, is it? Uh, there it is. Ah, crap, missed it. Thank you there again, there, uh, Patrick Deeswell, Seifer, and Brian. Appreciate it, guys. So, uh, so yeah, so if, if I were to create a mod, what would you guys want to see? This this ought to be interesting. If you're in chat, just throw it up there. What would you want to see? If it was like an FTG mod, what would that look like? I'm, I'm curious, like, what y'all would expect an FTG mod to look like. paid skins. I actually have a lot of skins. Actually. Um, I just have not released them. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh, Andrew. Oh, nice, man. Andrew coming in the house, man, with a 
big one, man. Been a while since I've seen Andrew in the in the uh, in the red, man. Thank you, there, Andrew. Appreciate that. What what are, what are we gonna give away now? <laughs> <coughs> Man, me and Andrew go back a long time, man. One of the one of the biggest supporters of this channel, man. He's uh, he's probably the reason why my wife let me play Gold Rush for all those times. Now we're just starting on streaming back then, and that was literally probably the last time. You're the streamer, you tell me. I don't know. How about uh, gosh, how about we uh. No right. Oh gosh. Uh, how about we do? Um, gosh, man, I wish we were doing. Uh, wish we were doing Pingus three eighty nine because he's he's gonna be. Uh, could do his. How about? Oh god, let me let me send. Uh, I tell you what, just hang on a minute. Let me send some people. Let me send and see if. Um, uh, let me see if uh, if if he's actually got his PayPal squared away because I don't want to send you guys uh, giveaways and then you know I'll be able to get the trucks. I'm just gonna send John a quickie and see if he's um if he's got something going on here if he's actually got it fixed. New notification for Facebook ads. Well, that's that's classy. <laughs> Sound mods. What would you like to say? <laughs> we could get some. Uh, what's the one we could do? We could do one of those um uh GPS ones. FTG GPS. <laughs> You're probably like what the. Hey, what's up? Oh, did it? Oh, it certainly did. Man, y'all get a good shot there of that nice knee. I always wanted the knee cam back. Thank you there, Anthony. Appreciate that, man. $20 donation there from Mr. Anthony, man. You guys are awesome. All right, so I've sent John uh, a message here. Um, gosh, now, we're, now we're in giveaway mode. Well, now that, Derek, we, I'm actually going to be working on. So, yes. I'll I'll fill you in there, Bray. Let me catch up here. Oh yeah, cap cap cam froze. That's typical. Does that all the time. I feel like. All right, there we go. So there's that. That's fixed. Get that light out of the way. There we go. Okay. Um. <laughs> Turn left at the hey Seifer. Thanks for the donation. I know, right? How about we um. How about we give away one of these magnitudes? You want to give away a... Y'all interested in a low boy tonight? Okay, and wait till the last one? Okay, all right. Okay, I'll tell you what this. How about let's do this? I am... Let's wait till we do the Peter Real 389. I kind of wanted to wait and find out from Andrew. Because I any, any time people sponsor for giveaways, I hate doing it myself and taking it. So how about this? Let's give away a truck, and let's give away a trailer from Pinga when we do his... When he do his... um. 389 how about that is that cool so i will give away uh 389 from peterbilt that's a 25 dollar donate i mean 25 dollar truck and i think it's a 20 dollar trailer which is the one we're playing right now so can we do that one all right sweet cool all right, i get the thumbs up from guys i'm like all right now now i can now i can continue <laughs> all right so here is our load it's a big old uh yeah it's a big old big old thing i don't think the uh yeah, obviously you wouldn't haul that with the front thing on there, but yeah, it's pretty cool. So anyway. <laughs> You're interested in the beanie? I know. Well, when I find the colors and they send me back my color sheet and we'll see what this next design looks like. If it looks better, I'm going to roll with it, man. Um, I was very disappointed in the, in the red. Since you wanted a pink cat. <laughs> Basically what it would have been. Hey, here's a pink FTG hat. Why is it pink? I don't know. They don't really offer red. <laughs> so I will, um, if you guys will, if you'll stick close to the channel after this weekend. So I usually don't stream on Sunday, Monday. So let's just kind of plan on preliminary. Unless something else breaks, it's very possible that something will break Tuesday. Like, uh, you know, Idaho or something. I don't know. 
if it does then i'll try to work the trucks in this week but um look for the pinga 389 and i will put up a post in the community section so as you're scrolling through checking you know your uh, youtube feed or whatnot um i'll have something in there that you guys can see um, and also post it on the Discord. So if you're in the Discord, I'll make announcements on that whenever we're going to do that truck and trailer giveaway there, courtesy of Mr. Andrew. So, what's up, Ace? Continue straight. Hmm, Lee, that I don't know. Uh, that would be a question for the sound modder designer. That'd be the only thing I can I can think of on that, man. Uh, work shirts are pretty expensive. But, uh, yeah, especially the ones like Mechanic Work shirts. But, if you guys are interested, I have a new a merch side store for the United Logistics section. So, if you guys are interested in a United Logistics merch, I've got some pretty awesome stuff that uh, I've been able to design. Um, and you guys can check that out. Um, it's in the description. It's, um, it's You'll see the merch store. And it'll have, uh, or you can do exclamation new merch. And it'll shoot you up a, a link here in the chat. Exclamation new merch. All one word. All right, somebody wanted all the gears. I'll, I'll give you all the gears here. Yeah, Hustle, this is a good one, man. Pinga does really good. Like, you know, Pinga does... Um, there, there are some things that I think he... I don't want to say that he struggles on, but there's definitely things that are his forte. And honestly, the um, this one is probably by far the best. It's good. It's good hustle. Turn right. Is it frozen? Oh my gosh, it is frozen again. All right, thanks. Yeah, I think this GoPro is about on its way out. You know how long? You know how many hours this thing's been rolling? It's been rolling a lot of hours. <laughs> All right, let's see. There we go. Yeah, it is, Andrew. They used to say that's the only reason they were here was for the knee cam. Because I was, at the time, one of the only, like, YouTubers that actually would, you know, show, like, what's going on beneath the steering wheel and the face, you know? <laughs> so they just said, well, let's do some knee cam. So then when I took this away, I went back to the full, like, you know, back way over here you know it was and then i yeah and then they started making the joke of bringing back the knee cam so uh i don't think so personally jacoby but i think the i think his freightliner classic is for those guys that like that kind of truck like the truck that you can put all the chicken lights on the chrome looks like a mirror uh john rudis actually looks like it's been worked in a little bit and i kind of like that realism um, aspect to it but that doesn't mean that this truck is trash or that it's not as good it just means that it's my preference but you may actually like the other one just fine I don't know one of the two Jordan Brown thank you there for the sub man appreciate it uh, well whenever I restart receiving some of this I still have not received my first bit of merch um, I got some t-shirts and um, I got some some other I'm gonna get some t-shirts of some different sizes um, here on this next run and then we'll see I've got some so I've got some t-shirts and I've got one of those neck gaiters just to show you guys what it looks like and then um, and then we'll leave some of that stuff we may we'll look at giving it away we'll, we'll do some company convoys whenever <laughs> whenever the uh, April 1-3 uh, ring 3-7 updates Hopefully not too long. No, nah, it's not a long. Just the uh, just a regular, just a reg. Oh, thank you. There is that Hopeton. Junior sent me over here to sub media. Well, thank you, man. Uh, friends, no. 
maybe streaming acquaintances maybe he's popped in my chat a few times i've popped in his chat a few times so i guess if that's what your uh your your level of um necessity of uh yeah yes then so sure i think we're about to do a big load in here yeah there it goes load in the brand new stock and i haven't driven in this very much the big sound barriers pretty awesome actually uh, well, boy, they say um, that they're 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 really they're really trying to figure out how to best implement the F mod sound structure. It's not exactly, I guess, what they were anticipating. So, yeah. Yeah, all I know that doesn't sound too good. <laughs> oh, nice, man. Uh, Derek, uh, that's all in the Team Reforma, so the same guys that do Viva Mexico. So we're kind of back into, now we're in SES maps. Does it look familiar now? Yeah. Yeah, man, Jeff does good stuff, man. I've, I've followed Jeff for a while. I actually followed him for his uh, X-Plane. That's how I met him. Uh, not met him, but that's how I figured found him out as a streamer. And um, and that, I think at that time he was doing a lot of, still doing a lot of content for YouTube. I think he was streaming most of the stuff on Twitch, but I wasn't I wasn't following him on Twitch. But yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, it sure does look like it. Yes, it does. And then you get off on like exits like this where it's like a like literally a dive. Yeah, 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 Mr. Pettigrew. Yeah, I, I, uh, it's been a while since I've done the spin tire stuff, but uh, he's doing snow running and all that. And he's playing. I think he's playing with the controller. I think. Not yet for me. They still don't have wheel support yet built in, so we wait again. But I promise you, man, as soon as it comes out, we're we're gonna probably do a video there about it. I'm tired of snow runner. Bring back ATS FTG. Alright, who else does that? Don't y'all lie. So I do I do uh, skin loads. Well, I don't know skin loads for trailers. I could do that. Um, but I do skin uh, skin trailers and trucks. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of almost the point now where I don't even want it now, Jeremy. <laughs> kind of like, you know what? Take just, just, right here, take your game back. <laughs> I don't want it no more. <laughs> uh, truck and diet? No, I have not. I've never really watched Squirrel. Not that I don't like him. I just, um, I just never really watched him. Uh, they haven't released it yet, Seifer. Whoops. Hang on, there we go. Did I hope to come over? Yeah, he did there, Junior. <laughs> he did. I uh, played a few. Uh, we delivered a few loads over there, Derek. I haven't done too much there. It was like, yeah, it was like their alpha beta demo. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're just waiting on more info when they put that out there. I actually got another one for Dinosaur Bone Hunter. I was like, hmm. It's like, wow, we'll simulate anything nowadays. Here, here's personal hygiene simulator. Learn how to brush your teeth and take showers and put on deodorant. <laughs> Five stars on the Steam store. Worldwide top bestseller. Like, um... I heard some of those are pretty good, Seaver. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I missed a few gears.
Well, I like the, um, I tell you what, I do like the glass on this thing. I'm not sure what it is about this glass, but I like it. Y'all see it on the, on the, uh, on the actual mod, the load? Don't it look good? Yeah, it looks good. Continue your straight. We'll see if we leave Fresno. Uh, what we had an hour. So I did promise we'd do a cattle hauler. I have that in tow. We can do that. I promise we do the cattle hauler for bull or someone. I can't remember who wanted it. <laughs> Parenting simulator. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, oh boy, wouldn't that be? Hey, man, do you have your parenting license? You're pretty good at that game. Nope, I'm just a single dad living the dream, streaming on YouTube. Everybody be like, uh, okay. <laughs> so, there's a couple of space games. I would get into a space game, but none of you guys would watch it. Let's be honest, y'all wouldn't watch it. There's a game called Star Citizen that would blow your uh, your proverbial space mind, but I don't know how many in uh, the chat tonight would be all up for that. You did get to fly around and shoot stuff. <laughs> I wish there was a legitimate ocean, deep sea ocean fisher boat. That would be awesome. Luke, what's up, man? Let's see if we can drive, uh, we drive backwards for a bit. Hope nobody stops in front of us. We'll be all right. I like these headlights. Oh! <laughs> Ew. <clears throat> oh, snacks. Didn't mean to do that. Did I see 1% damage? Really? 1% damage? Wow. Some space trucking. That would be interesting. Hey, you know what's funny, Deuce, is I put on there that I didn't, uh, the left turn emote. You know, I put the left turn emote on there, the no left turn. <laughs> then I do NASCAR. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey, that's kind of like against your emote policy there, FTG. Yeah, this one actually, I, I think I ate this one. Yeah, no left turns. I'm like, well, I raced NASCAR. How do you get around no left turns? I like, I literally gave myself a troll emote there, Deuce. Literally gave myself a trolling emote. Like, you gotta be kidding me, I did that. I really did it. <laughs> yeah, we just picked that one up, moved it out of the way. Uh, it actually is both Hitman, but right now the multiplayer is not updated. So, right now it's just single for right now, but, um,. It won't be, hopefully, within a week. Fingers crossed. You'll have to come up and uh, and see what we do for our. Um, you have to see what we do for those, man. They're uh, they're pretty legit. We have. Uh, Turn left. We usually have quite oh. I have quite a few uh, quite a few people on our convoys. We're usually somewhere around the 60 to 80 range of trucks that drive with us. It's pretty awesome. Look at this uh, hand rubbed oil, oiled finished wheel right there, man. How would you? I would love to have a wheel like that, like an IRL, 22 inch wheel, just to drive on the stream. Look like I'm driving a big old school bus up here. What's up, Thunderwolf? How are you, man? Oh, well, I was driving backwards. That's pretty much what it, you know, amounted to. That happens from time to time when you drive backwards. You're not looking at where you're going. <laughs> You know, yeah, the other guys that do it actually see where they're going. They just do it anyway. Check out this sunset behind me. Oh my god, that's uh, that's screenshot material there. <clears throat> uh, 
Oh, well, he flipped it upside down and then it poked the wheel. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's not a bad idea if you got the room for it. I really want to get... Yeah, here we go. Yeah, well, there we go. I wanted to get this guy over here. Yeah, hit and run. I don't know. The truck hand me some fast hills gone. Uh, yes, Brian. They're on a, like a break week. They just rolled out a new a bunch of new content. Um, honestly, though, for right this this past week, uh, like literally, I streamed all that I could. To be honest with you, man, it was a busy, 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 busy week. So I hope that we can maybe by like next week or the next we can kind of pick up with like a normal, kind of a normalized schedule again, you know. It's, it's, just, it's hard, man, when it's busy. What up, Dev? Ah, it's all right, man. It, it, it happens, dude, quite often, actually. Yeah, quite often. What's up there, Mike Kelly? Kill Beef, what's up, man? It's been a while. How are you there, bud? Well, a studio tour. It's actually a dining room tour. Um, but yes. <laughs> uh, eventually, I, I think... So, I've always... Uh, I've, you know, we, we, I've actually talked about this a few times. Whenever we do these setups and um, whenever we do different things, I always talk about wanting to do a setup. But normally, it's because I'm always... I never do it because I'm always waiting on something else new. And I'm like, well, I want to kind of feature that into the setup. So, once we get the new shifter and do kind of like a reveal on the shifter... Um, then, then I'll do like a, a full over kind of what I have. Um, you guys can kind of figure out, you know, you know, some things I need to upgrade. Um, it's just not quite there yet. Of like the necessity to actually do it, you know. So, but yeah, we can we can do that. I really need to. Just so people stop asking. I just send them to a video. Look at that, man. It's crazy. Looks good. Looks good. Whose truck? This is John Ruda's Custom 900. Hey, what's going on, Mr. Baba Bong? How are you, buddy? A long time no see. I hope you're doing good. Yes, sir. Highway killer. Well, that's the fun of it, Jacoby. If you could buy it all tomorrow and drive it, it wouldn't be any fun because there'd be nothing else left to do. You know what I mean? Take right yeah, man. Well, I hope you're doing good. What's up, Mike Pinnagrass? Good to see Mike up in the house. Been a while, Mike. Hope you're doing well. Hope everybody in the fam's good. Going to the Walmart. Wow. Walmart's got a sale on their 856s. Don't roll back, literally. Actually, they're on low boy, not roll back. That was a record joke there for you guys that didn't know what a record's called. Okay. All right, let's go squeeze this thing in between the buildings and let's pick up a cattle hauler. See where we can uh, haul some bull. Yeah, we'll do that. Hmm. Which truck do I like the best? Honestly, it's probably... So I like uh, KI's Classics, because I've never really paid much attention to Classics, but he's got a 9300 I like a lot. The Dodge is interesting, um, with, and I love the interiors on both those trucks. Um, if it's a newer truck, I, I would definitely say uh, Rudis Freightliner Classic XL. I, I don't know why, I just I like the truck. People will hate me for it, I know. How could you do it? But I like it, man. It's a really good truck. Um, uh, Brian, no, I'll, I'll keep it FTG. Yeah, that's more channel oriented for everything, not just necessarily the trucking. But yeah, I'll, I'll probably keep that one the way it is, man. So if you, if you bought the FTG one, I'm not, I'm not planning on changing it. 
Now that I would feel awful, man. <laughs> I would feel terrible if we got in there and a bunch of guys were like, uh, what the heck, bro? You changed the logo on us. They're no longer, you know. Uh, yeah, that would be terrible, man. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> All right. Let's let's uh, let's go ahead and hop in. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Here it is. All right. So we can... Uh, do we want to... Yeah, I guess we can... I was just going to look and see. We got the triple on there. Do it for bull. <laughs> Chris Buchanan, a.k.a. Money. Money in the house, everybody. I heard he was giving some away tonight. All right, let's put this away. <laughs> All right, so where do you guys want to go? Where do you guys want to go? I got a lot of map. Uh, we can go, we go anywhere you want. If you can go great America, haul down the 80, we can do that. If you want to, well, I don't know if I get loads over there. I got to check. Um, we go, we go pretty much everywhere. Let's uh, let me go ahead and make it daylight. So let's do our trick. If you don't know this trick, hit the dev console, hit zero, uh, and then hit F9. And then voila, there is a trailer hooked to your truck. Yeah, it's a good one. All right. Uh, okay, so we are here at Fresno. So we got all this up in here if you wanted to see any of that. If you don't, it's fine. Don't have to do any of it. Um, I was kind of thinking maybe trying to haul something maybe out of Bakersfield up to maybe Tonopah or something maybe because this is all new. So basically, I think here the 395, this Lone Pine, Bishop, all of that is all new stuff. Um, but yeah, so yeah, we'll go to Iowa 80. Oh, okay. All right. Um, let me see if I can actually find a load there. I don't know that, um, these actually generate loads there and they don't, of course. Why would they? That would make too much sense. Well, this one does look at that Marquette actually. Oh, I guess that's cause we've, oh, that's right. We got to find one with a farm. Okay. So we are wanting to go to Walcott I 80. Let's see if anything's in Walcott. No. We can go to Cabo. That's crazy, ain't it? Cabo San Lucas. Mm. Marquette, Marquette, Marquette. So evidently the Iowa... Okay. So, um, all right. So, <laughs> so it doesn't look like we can actually go that far. So let me um, let's do a little uh, let's do a little investigation here. Let's hit the map so we can zoom in. And because we're going to find one that's got a because I have not seen any of this. So let's see if Gillette or any of these over here, it's kind of crazy ones up here. We'll see if any of these have that, and we'll come back in and maybe deliver in Idaho. Is that cool? Cause I don't, I can't deliver in the in the the I eighty. We can rest there. I guess if you wanted to go to Marquette, we could do that. <laughs> go through Walcott. Uh, Y'all actually wanted to do that, didn't you? What's up, Cody? All right. Let me let me see. Let me see. Let's see what we can do. So I am had two options for you. I think. So we can pull, let's see, when we get to it, the Cheyenne. So we can go all the way back to, so right here we can go back to Ontario. We take some horses from Cheyenne, Wyoming, up to 80, back up into Ontario. So that's one choice. We could definitely do that. Um, I want to see if there's anything else there. It does, but I don't know that what works with these particular map mods. My, my guess is probably not, but I'm not really sure. Um... So we've got, where have we got? We got Fort Dodge. Because I can always put myself a little far further forward. I just want to go 
Cheyenne. We got Gillette, Cedar City, Ontario. Of course, we're not going to Marquette. <clears throat> it's going to suck. So how about we take some fat hogs um, to Marquette? So that's the other one. Now, here's the thing. I'll pick it up in Fort Dodge, and then we'll actually dev console back some if you guys want to drive some. <clears throat> Cheyenne to Ontario. All right, so here's our two options. You guys let me know, all right? Uh, yeah, we're using the Kenworth. Yes, the W9. Yes. Um, so here's our two our two kind of options, uh, at least as of right now. We've got... Um, We've got Cheyenne over to Ontario, which is going to take us right through Idaho, uh, which is in, in the Great America map. Or we can, I'll pick it up here in Fort Dodge, but we can put ourselves back here on the 80 a little a little bit, and I'll pull into the um, I'll pull into the the I80 truck stop in Iowa. Whichever one you want to do, y'all let me know in chat. Just throw it in there. I'm glad that you don't care, Derek, because I really don't either. <laughs> I don't want it to be too long of a haul, but um <laughs> that bacon. All right, gonna do it already. All right. We've got a Fort Dodge. We'll pick him up. If it'll, yeah, it does. Look at there. Uh, type of tires. Uh, I use the Jess Mods 2.0 uh, custom Alcoas. All right, so we'll pick these up. <clears throat> we'll pick these up and we'll go make it daylight. And then we'll have to dev console out. All right, so there's those going to Marquette. So then we'll... Mm, where are they at? Where are they at? Okay. <laughs> you need some bacon. I need some bacon too. Um, I didn't put it in here. No, it's got one right there, but I don't actually have the interior spot in there. Like I don't, I don't choose to put that, fill that note in because I don't like it. Because the interior light comes on with the, uh, with it comes on with the beacon. So if you want to run something like that, if you want to run underglow, I don't want the interior light to come on. Y'all, uh, y'all feel me on that? Yep, that's, uh, no, it's not on the, no, not on that one there, artist. Not yet. At least I don't think so. I think it's only 389, but not his classic. I think. If it is, I don't remember it. All right. So we got a bunch of, uh, fat hogs up in there. So let's go ahead and let's change our eight o'clock. Oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful Iowa morning. Could you spell the pig crap corn growing in the field? All right, let's uh, let's pick up the city on the eighty. I love the eighty. Oh, I love eighty. Um, how about let's go back to? Because honestly, it was not going to take us long to get there. Um, Let's just go back to, uh, let's go back to 
Cheyenne. Is that okay? It's, there's really not a very. Not, it's really not a long line because once you get on eighty, man, it's like it's gone. <laughs> Is it a Kata ball of dogs? Woo! All right. Nope, they don't like that one. Let this load in. All right, if you don't know what this map is, this is one of the best, one of the best kind of user-created mods uh, of, and I'm including pretty much anything in Coast to Coast. I'm just gonna go in and tell you. If you can, if you can part with not, you know, literally driving. Well, we need to turn around, don't we? If you can literally part with not driving and having the whole U.S. He said he's working on Montana and then and the Dakotas next, because. Fingers crossed, shortly we're going to have Colorado and we're going to have Idaho. So just imagine even having this block plus Iowa and Colorado and Idaho and having this whole entire area deliver, man. Psh, man, dude, the map for ATS is literally starting to jam up. It really is. Uh, if SES will start releasing these, I, I swear, I feel like they've got this stuff done. They're just not releasing it. It's my my perspective. I think they need to get off the potter. You know, quit telling everybody they're working on it. Todd, what's going on, man? I need to come to Georgia. Georgia. I'm talking about in uh, in the game or in IRL. Not in the game. <laughs> yeah, I've come to Georgia on coast to coast. Tennessee and Georgia and South Carolina, North Carolina, and Florida aren't too bad. I don't necessarily really care much about any of the rest of it, but that, those aren't actually too bad. Oh, nice, Zach. Sweet dude. Yeah, y'all have to show some pictures on that, man. I, I'm anxious to see you guys and wearing that because I, I actually had fun designing that one. That would be good, man. I, and mine's supposed to be here any day. It's already been shipped. I don't know when it's going to be here, but when I do, you guys can actually see that one as well. I'll, uh, I'll wear it on stream one night. That way you guys can check it out. Sometimes people don't like to buy stuff unless they can actually see it being worn. You know, it's like, well, if he doesn't want to wear his own merch, I'm not going to wear it. Let's redesigned our uh, our uh, all of our trucking company stuff. All got to redesign on the logo, so it's legit now, man. This is from Bart's Custom Mods. So Bart's on Facebook. Uh, Eighteen dollars for the trailer. There's a couple of free ones out there, but his is by far on the payor side the best. Basically, what I'm doing, Derek. Three of them. Buttons, DJ. Till my shifter uh, gets done. It's uh, custom made from uh, custom eating. I uh, know, Cody. I just went ahead and modded it in myself. I know how to do all that. I create my own profiles with a couple of the tools that's you know readily available, and find all the cities, put myself some money, experience points, because I'm all the time ruining profiles and doing things. I I can create a new profile in about five minutes now. It's kind of funny. All right, fixing a hop on the 80 here. Uh, how do you get the braking sound? What do you mean the braking sound? I think it's part of the sound mod, I think. What do you mean, do I still? Do I still what? Yeah, trucks paid there, Siobhan. 
Yes, the white. Yeah, yeah, the white and blue. Yeah, that was John Rudis 389. That was legit too. When I pressed the brakes, you mean like that? I'm talking about that? That? Continue straight. I think that's what you're talking about. I'm assuming that's with the engine mod or the sound mod. I don't really know where that comes from, to be honest with you. I have the sounds fix mod, which is very well possible that's what it could be. Here we go, back to Des Moines. That might be what it is, Bull. Yeah, I agree, Cody. Agreed, man. He sounds monstrous. He asked if the light bar does work, it does work. See? Yeah, Mike. Yeah, man, Mr. Andrew James came in and threw the proverbial hammer down. <laughs> uh, do I have a real air brake control turned on? Uh, do you have a, what do you mean by that, Josh? What's up, Dallas? Yeah, just regular brakes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so it may be the sounds fix pack. He may have actually done something where it overrides all the truck brakes. Honestly, I don't, I don't even think about it anymore. <laughs> yeah, it would be kind of cool, actually, there. <laughs> Maybe one of these days, man, somebody would get, like, a decal made. Be like, hey, man, I'm just supporting the uh, company colors. Don't tell the boss IRL, you know. You might get mad. All right, Nebraska, here we are. It's all you Nebraskanians out there. It's pretty nice, actually. Kind of tough to drive like that, but, you know, it's, it's okay. Eighty-five, this, this won't take us long at all. Oh, we bout. Oh, hey, 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 I didn't see three wheels there. <laughs> Woo. Hmm. So. Hmm. So, field of view on a track IR, it changes with the truck. Um. Uh, it changes with the truck and normally what I'll do um, I have my own custom track hour set up um, but I have um, I, I, I'm thinking I'm running about 72 give or take what's up will be the Jake break sounds awesome the horn is default city horn and uh -oh, big horn big boy horn Oh, Robbie Wilson. Holy crap, man. Thank you there, Robbie. Upgraded Fanatec based on the recommendations. Expensive. Yes, not sure if I should get pedals or shifter next. I have Thrustmaster right now. Thoughts. Oh, my gosh, man. Thanks, Robbie. Wow, 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 man. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate that, man. It's awesome, man. Dang. Um, well, shoo. Um, so, what'd you get on Fanatec? What'd you get? Did you get the wheel? So I would think what you get next depends on what you want to do and what you're playing. All right, all right, awesome, man. Um, so you got the Fanatec wheel. So, so what kind of games do you play? I racing and ATS. Okay, likewise. So, um, so here's here's my thing. It depends. It depends. 
So I've got the um, I've got the the I've got the elite inverted pedals, the V threes, and um, so the V threes that are regular aren't really any different than mine, except for mine come inverted and come with their load cells that are adjustable on the preload and the actual brake cell load. Um, the the I come with a couple springs on the clut. I mean on the 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 accelerator and the clutch comes with a lot more room of travel so I think it probably depends on exactly what you want to race with it if you want to do hill toe stuff like rally stuff um, or really any kind of road course race that requires that um, I, I would stay with the non inverted um, and just because the hill toe is kind of hard from the inverted over to the other one it just doesn't work as, as well as I would have anticipated on it or hoped it would um, here's the thing with the shifter. Um, I say at the price they generally are, I would say try to stick with a Fanatec shifter and the V3 regular pedals. Um, it's such a big difference from Thrustmaster, it's not even funny. Um, personally, I think the Fanatec shifter upgrade, you're only talking about less than $100 to get an upgrade on the shifter. And you can switch it on the fly, the sequential, um, pretty much any shifter you want to put on it actually screws right onto it. You don't have to worry about stuff. So if you want to do a shifter kind of like mine, uh, you can do it with actually IRL stuff instead of having to try to fab something up to fit a Thrustmaster one. Um, but that's just my personals. Because, yeah, and most everybody in the chat, I mean, you know, when you guys ask me, especially stuff that comes down to like, hey, what do you, what do you recommend on this stuff? I always say even if, let's say like in the month of June, well, I could get Thrustmaster right now, or if I saved up this month and put a few back, I could get that Fanatec by July. I would tell you all day long, wait, save your money, get the Fanatec in July. That would be that would be the that would be the deal for me. Um, for um, if you're asking pedal wise, um, there is um, they make a desk mount for the um, Fanatec shifter. Um, and actually, the no, no, wait a minute. I'm gonna tell you wrong on that. Yeah, so they make a, it's a, they make a, they make a, um, they make one. And I think I've still got mine. If you would want mine, I'll sell it to you. <laughs> if you want it that bad, I'll sell it because I'm not gonna use it. Um, it literally fits on the back and it's got two clamps and it clamps on the desk and it's. I used to use it on my IKEA desk and it, it like, yeah. Yeah, it's a desk mount. Yep, for uh, for Fantech. All right, all right. Well, hit me up in the Discord, man. <laughs> I'll hook you up. I don't even know if they actually still sell it on. Um, I don't know if they still sell it. Maybe they do. Because some of that stuff I've got to get rid of. Because I've just been hanging on to it for like what if in a rainy day, and I guess that rainy day is today. Uh, no, so this, uh, so that what you're seeing, guys, is, um, oh, they do still sell it? Okay. Um, so what you're seeing, guys, is the Great America mod. So these are the textures that, uh, that he's used on the roads out here. So we're no longer in ATS land. We are in the Great America map, which we are now in Nebraska, I believe. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, Derek. <laughs> All right, yeah, uh, yes, I would like to see that. <laughs> My farmer button box, uh, no, because I'm actually still, I still plan on using that. Actually, I actually still plan on using that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> uh, that's, that's this button box here. It's the box of buttons. I don't know if farming simulator come back. So I, I actually probably do some farming this week with the guys, CMP. Uh, we've got a server. I've just never really used it. Um, I kind of got out of the farming scene there for a while. Just so toxic. Just couldn't stand it. It's not toxic to be in it. But it's a toxic to be a YouTuber in it. I just didn't feel like dealing with the bull crap. So...
So I think what we'll do is probably do some playing around on it this week. So we, I've got a server, so it's up to 16 people. So I figure we got our got a custom American map on there with a lot of really awesome stuff on it. I figure why not, man? We need to get out there and use it. So. <laughs> it looks way smarter than you are. <laughs> That's hilarious, man. <laughs> What's up there? Is that uh, Sidu? Sidu, bro? What's up, man? What's up, Sid? How's it toxic? Uh, it just is. <clears throat> All the Facebook's toxic with it. Uh, the forums are toxic. It's just... It typically becomes toxic when uh, anybody on PC does anything uh, farming sim-wise. A million people come in and say, Is it available for console? When's it coming out for console? Are you going to do it for console? Then everybody gets all upset and mad. Feelings get hurt. People say stuff. It's just, you know, I see it all the time. Well, it's not jealous. I mean, it just, it's just the way it is, man. Farming Sim really geared, geared themselves towards console. So, uh, it used to not be that way. They used to gear themselves towards PC and then offered a console release. Now they really focus on the console and, yeah. PC will just, they'll be fine on their own. <laughs> they'll do what they want to do. What's up there, Canadian Mist? <clears throat> their map that makes the way through Vermont. Nope, not really. Unfortunately. <laughs> what's up, Cruel? What's up? Yeah, well, you're welcome, man. No problem. Matt Standard, what's up? Good to see a lot of new names, man. Appreciate you guys coming out and hanging out with us here. Got a little uh, 900 a with a got a cantaloupe hauler on the back there, Bart's. It's always good. John Root is here leading the way in the uh, Kenworth 900. I actually featured one of Pingo's Low Boys. And by the way, for you guys that maybe one of those next week, probably either Tuesday or Wednesday of next week, um, I will because uh, I usually don't stream on Sundays and Mondays. I usually try to take those days off and just kind of do some stuff that I really randomly want to do. Um, <clears throat> and I'll. Um, I'll probably um, I'll probably either start on uh, Tuesday. We're going to do a, um, a a Peterbilt 389 giveaway, and that is the new one from Pinga, which is uh, new to probably most of you guys, unless you've been on Facebook. Some guys have been streaming it on Facebook, but um, but yeah. So I'll be in that Tuesday. We're going to do a giveaway on that one. That's 25 bucks, and also we're going to give away a trailer if he has courtesy of our own Mr. Andrew James. So um, y'all thank him. Uh, super nice of the way he supports the channel financially and everything else, man. He's been uh, been here a long time, two plus year member, and uh, it's good to, good to have him along for the ride, man. So, so he's uh, so he's doing his thing. So we've got us a couple things we're gonna be giving away this uh, this coming week. So if you guys are interested in an awesome low boy, plus a 389 from Pinga, which uh, what I hear has a lot of customizations on it, uh, then show up here Tuesday. Uh, I think if I can get everything uh, set up streamwise, we'll roll that out Tuesday. So, yeah, cable management is important uh, to the best of your ability. Sometimes you really just can't, you know, manage it perfectly. I, I pretty much have grouped all of my stuff. I don't like try to route it, custom, you know, do it through conduit and all kind of crap. Some people do. Um, I actually have mine all in zipper bags, like they're the neoprene. Um, they're like the 24-inch neoprene zipper bags. So I'll put all the cords. I'll neatly roll them up, you know, like in a long roll, and I'll put them, pack them all in, and then I'll zip them up, and uh, and it keeps everything together, like all my, um, all of my USBs come off the wheel and the pedals and all that stuff in one zipper bag. It's awesome. I love it. I say 84, fixing to hit a time change, I think. Time zone switch. Clouds get a little crazy here in a minute. Yeah, you can use zip ties, but you gotta wind up cutting them. This way, I can just unzip them out of the zipper bag, and then I can zip them back up. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, man. Ah, uh, Sebastian, they saw years of us saying, "Oh, it's PC only." It's a wonderful mod for PC only. Now you, know, you can do anything on console now. Just kind of crazy. 
but yeah they, they got tired of hearing of that so now every time that you know something comes up most of the time it's uh, available for about everything nowadays especially you can about assure sebastian whenever the new uh the new consoles come out and the new farm sim comes up they're gonna have a lot more power uh to do everything so the really the only thing they'll be fighting against will be uh only thing they'll be fighting against is is um uh what you call it like uh licensing branding and uh you know, won't really have any performance limitations they might have like written plug-in uh you know exceptions for different things they can't do obviously but other than that that'll be about their only be about their only stuff they won't be able to do <laughs> i know ace <laughs> i didn't realize that i was like that's kind of a sharp turn coming up Woo! yeah <laughs> Hi, right, Cody. Have a good buddy. Yeah, pretty much. And so, yeah, so you're right, Jeremy. I mean, the only thing you really be living it to is going to be, uh, you know, what the console makers are going to allow, allow uh, modification wise. <laughs> Smell of it. <laughs> oh man, y'all remember when Farm Sim did that? It was so stupid. The guy was like. Psst. Smell a, a hint of tarry pine. It's like, what the frick is this? <laughs> well, it's a good thing, Bull Holler. It's, yeah, it's a good thing we're on ATS, you know, because it is a game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Scratch and sift some on it. That would be weird, though. That would be just weird. Uh, can you get the skin made for the Pete? Which one? The 389? I'm going to put that up, Chris. I, I just haven't I haven't totally buttoned that one up. I need to make some, change the mod image and fill the manifest out. I haven't done that stuff yet, like mod stuff, but I can, uh, I'll probably be able to get that done here in the next few days, man. I'll put it up there on Discord. If you're uh, keeping up with our FTG paint job room. Cool, man. Yeah, I like, man, both those, the Freightliner and that one turned out really, really good. I had to manipulate some on that Freightliner one quite a bit, but I got it to follow that body line. Some stuff, man. <laughs> All right, more than halfway there. We actually, uh, yeah, we actually probably went back a little further. Now, well, I'll take that back. We're not going to be... Um, not going to be going back too far let's see Lincoln already yeah we're already in Lincoln Nebraska so we're going to be stopping at the at the I-80 truck stop so it's not totally finished but I, at least I don't think it is uh, but it's the last stop on the list here and uh, these are actually going to Marquette but we'll stop in the I-80 because that's where everybody wants to go it's okay that's fine by me America Play Kirby, we'll sip. we goes Sean Smith hello from Jamaica what up man how are you holographic well I'd be pretty much just the same as just going and doing it a high rail and getting actually paid for it yeah Omaha Nebraska Omaha Omaha's next we're going through Lincoln now Uh, what is the what is the font you use? Don't really remember off the top of my head. <clears throat> yeah, think about the triple option. <laughs> <laughs> I 
think we gotta get in front of these guys. Fish tail foods. Been supportive. I don't know. We'll we'll pull some flats. We've actually got a couple of flats. We got Bart's flats. We've got the Benson 45. Uh, eventually, we're going to get the Rudis flatbeds. Going to get an update. Penga's got his flatbed. So we've got like we've got like three or four now. Oh, nice man, Todd. Buy a horse for the daughter. All right. There's Omaha. Pretty good the way this guy's done cities. Um, I think next week I want I want to show something to you guys next week. It's an ETS two mod. I know, I know, I know. You're probably thinking, Bleh. Bleh. but uh, seriously though, it's like, yeah, it's not even in Europe. It's actually somewhere else, and it's totally awesome. And this is one of the few maps that actually allows you to actually get into the downtown areas. Same way on the ETS two map. Cool trailer to give away? It would be, Drew. It would. And I would have given away had you not called me Tilt. Hmm. Yeah, Project Japan is absolutely incredible, which is the one I like. Hope you can't take that one. <laughs> yeah, he's probably like, dang. That's what she said. I was going to give one away, but he did not. Nope, nope. Just had to call me Tilt. Hey, aren't you that other guy? Hey, we're almost at 40K, by the way, so I have to say thank you guys. There we go. People of Iowa, welcome you. Thank you guys. Oh, yeah. It's good, just different. Yeah. Japan, yes, and it is awesome. Standalone map, absolutely incredible, man. I'm going to roll it, man. I'm going to roll it this week. There won't be nobody watching. I would love for all of you guys just to come. Just support me. Don't come support ETS2. Just support me. <laughs> but it is absolutely fantastic. Fan freaking tastic. Some of the best city scenery I think I've ever seen. Uh, the depth of the in town, like the the big cities in Japan, they've got modeled in so far. Oh, it used to be a, a one to one scale, then they changed it and made it a one to nineteen. So their hopes that they're going to be able to actually make it in as an add on. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. You can't do ATS Japan, so you'll have to. I, I, I promise, though. I've got a, I've got a, I've got a banging truck that you guys, I, I think, will appreciate. Open pipes and all. It's a V8 open pipe. Sounds awesome. Yeah, ETS. I don't know. We'll do it next week. <laughs> Logan Leach. What's up? Took me a while there, Mike. Clever man, clever. I took. I was like, "What is he talking about, man?" It's this guy spoken, man. <laughs> you, you, you probably just need someone to like give you the right settings for it. Once you get the right steering settings on it, it's not so damn sensitive, man. It's uh, yeah, it's good. Uh, well, I'm racing uh, 6:39 tonight. Most of the ETS engines I run are 7:30. Oh, but it's amazing, Donovan. You would love it. You guys just got to give it a chance, man. I couldn't tell you how many guys in the um, in the Discord. Man, I'll never drive freaking ETS, man. Dad, give driving on the side of the road all the time. Man, just give me a Caterpillar 
give me this, give me that, I'll be fine. Give me a Peter. Just give me Gramps Peter and I'll be fine. Then, you know, two weeks later, oh my God, man, I'm in ETS and I'm loving it. Of course you are. <laughs> I don't lead you astray. <laughs> Uh, well, the field of view is not changing. It's actually like if you took your mouse and rotated, it's the same thing. So I've got a little sensor here, track IR, and uh, so I can you know, do all kinds of cool stuff with it. It works for your, especially your single player, uh, single monitor, man. It's awesome. Thing we could pass that because we were about to get a uh, mouthful of water. Uh, it changes, bull. It depends on how in demand it is. I think it's about 140 or 50 bucks. I think. Mower man, I think the default one does. I think the default 900. They've got a mod for that over there. There we is. Beautiful. Go to the Iowa 80 uh, truck stop, by the way, too, guys. If y'all are just joining and wondering where the heck's he going, there would be us. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it, yeah. Well, you don't need to, Derek. They do sell uh, just a regular track IR is uh, a hat clip. So if you like wearing hats, then you can clip it on. But if you're in a room that has a lot of sunshine, don't just do the, sun, the, the hat clip because it won't work. Not that great. Because it works via reflection, and sometimes that reflection overloads the sensors, and it doesn't work. Or it goes haywire while you're trying to drive in a bit. It's like someone grabbed your mouse and just went sh -sh 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 all over the table. That's what your fuel start doing in ATS. It's not, it's not the best thing ever. So, I am not Jordan Brown. I'm not a truck driver. I've just played uh, over 2,000 hours of this, and I, I pretty much know what ATS needs and, and wants and what its desires are. <laughs> I'm good, more man. Yes, yeah, I never was the Toby Eye Tracker kind of guy. I never liked that. It just something about it. Just I don't just I don't want to say it rubbed me the wrong way. It just didn't. I don't know. All right, Des Moines. Here we is. I have never driven a semi in real life. One of these days, I'd like to say I did. Be nice. What is DoorDash? I don't even know what DoorDash is. Gotta make sure I don't miss my uh okay. Make sure I don't miss my thing. Oop, oh, got a big load in there. Yeah, so here's Des Moines coming up. So you got both sides of the road. I 80 cuts right through the middle of Des Moines. City over there. It's a party over there. Party over there. Pretty nice. Roads on both sides. Pretty sweet. I don't know if Des Moines looks like that, but it's a pretty decent representation. <laughs> it's food delivery. <laughs> uh, I, yeah, I don't know, Jeremy. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't know, man. Uh, I don't think we have DoorDash where we are. We have to call it something else. All right, Rob. Yeah, no problem, man. I'll check it. Desmones. Desmones. Uh, agent. Yeah, I think I said that last time, or well, a couple streams ago, I said that we were discussing. Uh, you know, even in ETS, you always seem to like pass the city, but you never actually go through it. The thing that I wanted to say about the ETS in the uh, Japan series is the fact that on that standalone map you actually there's like two or three different ones you actually go and you actually are in the middle of the city and they've got a bunch of one-way streets you can only do right turns to get back to the interstate i mean it's crazy and it actually works and it's it's awesome i mean their road reconstruction in that map is incredible so that's that's why i want to do it man it's just an awesome map i figured you know we'll run a really loud open pipe Scania motor, you know, something that's just, it's still kind of manly and beefy, even for your European bros. Here, most people like it. It's Modes.
Oh, yeah, there you go, Josh. What's... <laughs> Hey, you know what, dude? Uh, more power to you guys, man. Y'all, IRL. If I drove IRL all the time, mm, there's no way I could come home and do it. That's like guys that farm come home and then play farming sim. I'm like, why would you want to simulate what you're doing and getting paid for it? Get in the mic. No. Uh, we've had this one. Uh, we've had this one for a while. A long time, actually. Uh, Pro Mods, the Japan map is Project Japan, uh, separate than the rest. It's like a totally standalone. It's all you get. Uh, all you get is Japan. All right, see so you killed. <laughs> Am I ever gonna retire? Nah, I'll, I enjoy it. You know, uh, you know. Part of this too is like a content creator. It kind of has to do. You know. Kind of has to do what people want to watch. Um, until I have more time on my hands, um, people want to watch this, so that's what I'll continue to do for right now. Owns a Volvo. <laughs> yeah, Ryan, it is. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, it actually is pretty close. I try to do that on a regular basis. It is a, a triple, though. They do have one in the uh, the SEI uh, wheel pack, but that wheel pack's not a it's not compatible with with uh, with Rudis Kenworth, so I haven't driven it yet. Yeah, we give away one of those trucks. So you guys here, especially if you're new, we're going to give away one of Pinga's trucks here. Uh, we'll give it away um, twenty five dollars value. We'll give it away. Um, on uh, Tuesday, I believe, as long as nothing comes up. I'll try to let you guys know. Schedule it early so you guys can see it. We'll do a Peterbilt 389 giveaway from Pinka and also one of his low boys because that's my favorite trailer of his. Um, so obviously, we're going to we'll throw that down this week, uh, this uh, coming week. So you guys, make sure you come out. Check that out on Tuesday. We'll give both those away. Courtesy of Mr. Uh, Andrew James for tonight's stream. He gave a, a nice, uh, sizable donation there to make that happen. So thanks to him for that. I appreciate that. Yes, I knew the only reason half the people show up there. Can you give it something away? No. Okay, I'll see you later. I gotta go watch somebody wreck on Facebook. It's more entertaining. We'll see you there, pal. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's got a lot, Jeremy. He's he's put a lot of stuff into that truck. After when I first got it, I couldn't get it to work, man. It kept crashing all the time. All right, so we're getting close to the. Uh, we're getting close to the um, I-80 gas station here. Truck stop, I should say. Cause I, I actually don't think I need to go that way. I think I think I still go straight. Uh, walk out I-80. There we go. I love it when the signs actually point you to the right way. It's so wonderful. All right, walk out I-80. Here we go. Oh, thank you there, Chris. Appreciate it, man. <laughs> well, I try to do what I can, man. <laughs> oh, we just, you know, Jacoby, we've said this in, it said this in stream, man. Like, you can literally go to Facebook and watch a million guys run off the road, miss gears, grind gears, drive automatics, drive whatever. And then nobody says anything. Everybody just hee haws and says, oh, that's so funny. Look at him. He can't drive. He's just like me. And then they get into my stream and they're like, hey, FTG, you missed a gear. <clears throat> you grinding gears, FTG. What's your little off your game tonight, buddy? <clears throat> hey, when are you going to get a shifter top? I want to see that thing. <clears throat> you know, <laughs> so it's a constant troll in my stream, but everybody else gets away with it. So, yeah, it is what it is. Wait a minute. Is this it? I don't know if this is it or not. I can't remember. Nope. Let me go one more. We're not ready for Iowa City yet. Too early. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, see, Todd knows what I'm talking about. If you've ever watched one, you know what I mean. Hey, man, if you go watch somebody drive around with a horse on his head for the entire terrain and not say anything, that's your problem, not mine. <laughs> you don't know what to do? You got to pick what you like, man. Pick what you like and make content. Put yourself out there. Uh, 
It, it, it does look good on triple monitors. And honestly, when I played it before for like enjoyment, uh, yeah, I, I played it triples all the time. Uh, but unfortunately, like everybody in stream, like really, really wanted to see me do, uh, wanted to see me roll back to, um, roll back to singles. So that's what I did. I don't, I don't even know that one, Josh. I and I don't want to know that one, actually. <laughs> I don't want to know that one. Because that one right there already ticks me off and I don't even know. Alright, here we go. I guess we go up the bridge and over. Can't go that way. Oh! I was coming over, son of a... Wow, look at this. Hiller! Pigs are thirsty. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, let's throw her. <laughs> Big rig rolling in town. I'm just kidding. Yeah, we've had a couple of big ones there, Nathan. Yeah, man. We've had a uh, $100 super chat and $100 donation, man. It's been a big night, man. It's kind of weird. I never know what Saturday nights are going to be. Whether it's going to be Mimi or people are going to be trolly or. It's like people's like, hey, FGG's finally streaming after all weeks. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can I can get a little salty. I'll just let you guys know. Pretty awesome. So I have no idea if the Iowa truck, uh, the Iowa 80 truck stop, even looks remotely close to this. But I would say that this is pretty cool. There's a lot of business in here to actually, uh, you know, pick stuff in. And I don't know that it's completely. I would love to see. Uh, yeah. No. Have you ever had five hundred dollars donate? Uh, yeah, well, I actually had a thousand once. Really special guy. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> it's the way it always is, Derek. <laughs> oh man, I get spicy at the end of streams. Get late. I figure it's pretty good, you know, for someone that's never seen it. You, you kind of know it. I mean, I know it's there. I mean, heck, you got the IO80, like the, the, the online superstore is named after the IO80. <clears throat> um, all right. Sweet man. Yeah, I did, Andrew. I really did. Really did, man. It was super, super nice, man. Um, I'm always appreciative, man, of, the, of uh, any of the donations that people give me, man. It's, uh, it's it's uh it's always a it's always amazing. I can't say that enough. Sometimes I have trouble like, you know, actually uh you know, actually figuring out how to say thanks enough, you know, for stuff like that. Um how did you get the money for a setup as a kid? <sighs> Start building it, man. <laughs> uh you know, it's uh <laughs> You never know what you're gonna get. That's hilarious, double D's. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sometimes, sometimes I'm in a sometimes I'm in a spicy mood. Sometimes I'm in a pretty low mood. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Mega resources. Yes, mega resources. Yes. Uh, Ollie, we're using a 346E uh, from the, the Caterpillar from um, Z Mods on the Steam Workshop. Um, but yeah, so you can set up, man, it's probably like, I mean, I hate to say it, but it's working, dude, working, working hard for something, whether that's, uh, out doing things that you can get money for, whether that's, uh, you know, saving up allowance, asking for Christmas, birthday, just starting to build, man. Um, you know, and obviously if you're like a young, young kid, I mean, you know, there's a limit to that, you know, I get it. Um, you can't go out and spend five grand and get mom and dad to buy you five grand set up just to play ATS on you'd never do anything else, you know, so I mean, I, 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 you know, I get it, man. Uh, do you need to download? Uh, no, you only need to download the mega resources if you are wanting to run Viva Mexico. So, um, so uh, here I'll, um, I'll show you on mine. So, so Great America in itself only is going to come with just these three or four states um, stretched across here. I have Sierra Nevada, um, and I also have all of Mexico from uh, Team Reforma. And both of those require mega resources. And all that stuff is updated on their website that you can freely go download for free now. 
Um, and I think his does require the DLCs as well. That's uh, at least so far that's when it's been released for ATS. Um, so you only need the mega resources in the mega resource patch if you're actually running the Team Reforma stuff. So no, that's not how much I paid. Um, I, I've I've probably got less than that, but I'm just throwing out a random number. You know, whether it's four grand, five grand, three grand, two grand, whatever, because you got to buy a PC in there as well. And if you don't have that, you have to have the PC. Unless you're going to do like racing and other stuff, you know, buying a setup for, you know, something racing wise on a console, that'd be about, you know, the best you can do. Um, but, um, but yeah, I mean, uh, you know, luckily ATS and ETS don't require a huge uh, jammed up, you know, PC. But if you're going to run a lot of stuff with it, it's going to take something, you know. All right. See you there, Mike. Have a good man. <laughs> you didn't even notice. I know, man. <laughs> uh well Stelic uh pretty quickly it's just seventy seven hundred K. Um, you know, it's uh it was, it was a top of its uh top of its line at the time. Uh but I've got a uh I've got a ten eighty TI and I've got a ten sixty overclock for stream uh capture as well as um just uh basically offloading all the stream encoding onto that and video encoding and you know the rest of the stuff's you know, you know, power supplies and all the rest of it. 32 gig of RAM. So it's pretty, it's, it's, uh, I'd say it's averagely beefy now considering what's out there, um, uh, what's out there now. Um, but it's, uh, you know, it's all about what you needed to play, you know? And, uh, actually when I built that, I didn't, had no idea I was going to go for, uh, go for a three, go for a three monitor setup. I had no idea I was going to do that. Had I done that, I would have done going totally different route, but you know, no, I have just the I seven. Yeah, and that was that was you know a couple years ago. Now that was the top of the top of the man, the Cabby Lake dude. That was the that was the big boy in town. <laughs> Didn't take long for that to be outdated. So, but anyway, that's gonna be it for me, guys. Uh, thank you all for coming and hanging out. It is um it is uh it's been awesome. I have a few shout outs here. I want to make sure that I get to uh, Brian King, Seifer, Patrick D, Andrew James, man. Thank you very much, Anthony Krakowski as well. Thank you, Robbie Wilson. Big thanks to you, man. Some big donations in there as well tonight. Uh, Captain Chaos, uh, so I got Brian King, Mo Lebo, uh, Perfect Dipper, getting everything started off tonight. A couple new members, uh, Timbo resubbed up, uh, which he'd already was before. Mr. Worldwide became a, a member again, so he's up into a year. Uh, a couple new subs as well, and I don't know, we're going to have to do something. We're getting really close to 40K. Um, I'm not sure what we're at now, but we were we were about 40 or 50 away, something like that, um, tonight. So, uh, yeah, I'm... I'm, I'm uh, I'm anxious to see, you know, how, how quick we can, you know, get up to 40 K man. So it's, um, it, it's awesome, man. I'm, I'm super stoked that you guys would want to, you know, to hang around here and, and, and watch drive and, you know, have a good time and streaming and stuff that 40,000 people. I was thinking the other day, someone said, well, you need a lot more subs. And, and I had a good friend of mine in the discord said, well, you know, you could actually fill up Carolina Panther stadium with your subscribers. And that put it into perspective. Um, you know, whether it's, uh, whether you've got 1.4 million guys that just sub to you because of your name or whatever, man, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's super cool to think I could fill up a football stadium with the subscribers of my YouTube channel. So, um, and I really can't complain with that. And just like that, man, uh, Chris Buchanan, thank you there, man. First gear member there. Uh, appreciate it, buddy. Um, it's a, it's a great way to support too, guys. If you're like, well, I don't have $20 donations to drop out. Maybe you got four bucks a month. You know, uh, it certainly does help this thing going. And uh, the more guys that do it, the better it is. Um, and it's, uh, I'd much rather have more, more smaller, smaller numbers uh, with more people. You know, I've always said I, I like, I'd, I'd love for 50 people to give $5 a piece rather than just five guys, you know, give the $50 and bankroll the whole thing. You know, um, I'd much rather have a lot of people give small donations. That's, um, it's, it's awesome to see that. So, so thank you guys. Appreciate all the support, man, from the subs to the members, to guys that are donating big money, to the guys that donate the two dollars. It's all equally appreciated, and I'm uh, I'm super stoked, uh, super stoked for that. And hopefully, 40k. Who knows, man? Maybe eventually we can start picking things up, get some more content out there, and get get YouTube get get us rolling up to that 100k mark. So it'd be awesome. Uh, what an uh, uh, be an awesome achievement. So. Anyway, uh, so next stream. So uh, if I, it's possible that I may race tomorrow, I'll have to. I'll just have to play that one by ear. It depends because I have to get started so early for racing uh, because I have time to races on the hour. And then they're the ones that I race at ten. Yeah. That, mm -mm. So uh, either tomorrow we'll be doing some racing on on here on YouTube, 
or it'll be Tuesday. We'll have the 389 giveaway plus the low boy giveaway. Uh, and then hopefully 40k, we may give away something nice for you know for uh, for a 40k special. You know, uh, who, who knows, man? <laughs> Sentimental moment. That's shut it, man. If I ain't crying, you can't cry. <laughs> so anyway, uh, Chris, what's up? We knew the ATS were good, man. Well, you got lots to learn, man. Lots to watch. It's gonna be good stuff, man. So uh, Southern slang, what's up? I am good, man. So I'm just actually just uh, just finishing up here. So. Uh, thank you guys. I appreciate it. I will see y'all here hopefully either tomorrow or we'll be back live here again Tuesday uh, this coming week. Usually take Sunday and Mondays uh, or take at least take Mondays off. Uh, just do some other stuff. But anyway, I'll see you guys here real soon. Thanks. Uh, everything for you guys. Appreciate it, man. The donations, all that stuff. It's awesome. So, uh, oh yeah, there you go. That's what I thought, man. Yeah, I, th I thought, yeah, he is selling, but he's having problems with PayPal. So, yeah. So we'll see, man. So thank you there, guys. Appreciate it. Absolutely. You guys have a great one. Uh, that's right. As, uh, wait a minute. There it is. As Derek says, bye. Stay safe, everybody. We'll see you here in the next time. Y'all take care. We'll see.